Marcellus Shale has only been talked about in complex terms. Billion dollar deals, huge drill operations, fracking solutions that take you back to high school chemistry class. But the Marcellus Shale itself, it's actually a huge rock. It's a huge black rock that primarily lies under parts of Pennsylvania and New York. Marcellus Shale has family members across the country. There's the Barnett Shale in Texas and the Fayetteville Shale near Arkansas, to name two, but Marcellus is the big brother of the group, stretching 600 miles or the distance from Pittsburgh to St. Louis. Why so much interest in Marcellus? Well, it has a lot of gas that can translate to a lot of green. Marcellus Shale is now known for the huge deposit of natural gas found in the small openings throughout the rock. Openings that can simply be pores or just small fractures. To access the gas, companies will create more fractures through a controversial process called fracking. Fracking creates more openings in the rock and allows gas to escape and be collected. To access the gas, companies must drill down 7,000 feet. 7,000 feet, that's like stacking eight U.S. steel towers on top of one another. Natural gas can heat homes, cook food, and even fuel cars. And at a time when filling up the gas tank can require a second mortgage, the huge reserve of Marcellus Shale has many thinking it could be a viable source of alternative energy. Most of the active drill sites around Pittsburgh are in rural communities, especially in Washington and Greene counties. There, gas company representatives started leasing land from landowners in 2007 and have drilled ever since. And with drill sites producing profitable gas for decades to come, it doesn't look like we've heard the last of this huge, powerful black rock.